Hello everybody, uh, finally arrived at uh, Acadia National Park, so and I just check into my campsite tonight. Um, anyway, right now I'm walking um, on one of the trail here, I think Schoonick Trail or Schoonick Head. I don't know if I pronounce uh, the word right, but anyway, I'll, I'll provide the name up top. Um, but yeah, I'm just scouting around for location right now and um, hopefully you can find a uh, sunset shot um, today. And but yeah, Acadia, so beautiful. And it's definitely classic, classic Ming here. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna I have a few plans today. I'm wanting to head to the uh, the summit to check it out and um, see if I, maybe I can find sunset shot up there. But I think it's gonna be a sunrise location, so I'm gonna save that for sunrise um, tomorrow morning. But I want to drive there anyway to check it out um, and to uh, see if I can find a composition and uh, but right now I'm just enjoying the scenery and uh, just look at that it's amazing yeah can't complain so I'm gonna drive around a little more and uh, see what else I can find I was walking around and um, I actually found there's a little cave right here yeah I don't know if I can uh, find a composition in there but it's high tide right now. I feel like there's a few stuff rock right here that you can go in and uh, stand from the inside out. Sunrise I think is happening on this side right here so it might be might be a good shot um, but it does I'm gonna look around a little uh, before I'm gonna do that um, make sure it's not dangerous. Yeah so I found a way into um, this cave right here and it's actually not that dangerous. I'm not sure when it's high tide, um, if it get wet, it might be a little bit more dangerous than now, but it's all dried up right now, so. And yeah, I'm right in front of the cave right now. Super cool. Um, I'm gonna see if I can go down a little more right there, and uh, uh, maybe I'll come back in the morning, but uh, I have a few more places to check out. And, uh, yeah, just gotta go on my list today. Right, I'm on uh, another trail right now. Um, I think this is called the uh, Auto Cliff. And uh, yeah, I, uh, I look at the, the map and it uh, seems like this little tiny trail that you can go down to the, uh, the cliff area. So I'm gonna explore a little bit. And uh, but yeah, it looks like it's a sunrise location as well. Um, anywhere along this, um, this coastline. And um, so one thing that concerned me that um, is when I was looking on the, the tide chat for tomorrow morning, um, it looked like it's gonna be low tide tomorrow at 5 a.m., um, which is the sunrise time. So I don't know, I had to find something, um, some composition that worked with low tide because uh, I was thinking of using the wave as the, um, as the foreground to add some um, texture to the, uh, the shot, but that might not happen depending on, uh, depending on the location. So I'm gonna, walk around anyway and uh, see what I can find but um, if not I might do sunrise at another location uh, maybe up in the, um, the summit but anyway I'm just gonna walk around anyway so hopefully see what I can find so the whole weekend I did not get any good image and the two images that I'm about to show you was actually taken the week after I was very close of scrapping this whole videos the light just wasn't great and I did not plan on the tie which is fairly important when you are shooting any seascape. Plus these locations are filled with people and it's very difficult to work with. But that's okay though, I'm glad that many people are out and appreciate the beautiful nature as much as I do. So in order for me to complete this uh, videos, I decided to go back again. Um, it was actually a family mini trip so I did not do any filming during the week but I was able to capture two images that I really like so that I can complete this video so I hope you enjoyed it <laughs> 